I was out exploring, looking for subjects to photograph, I, uh, I was walking along a trail, and I noticed this solitary flower just sitting by itself in the forest. It was surrounded only by grass and trees, and uh, I wanted to convey the solidarity and loneliness in this photograph. Thank you. Great job, Martin. I really like the way you captured the, uh, the solitude. He imbued his subject with emotion, right? Also, exposure, perfect, am I right? Thank you. But there's just something about the angle that doesn't feel right to me. I think you could have done more with it. I think you could have experimented a bit with the angle. Well, I wanted it to have a bit of an uneven feel to kind of emphasize uh, the loneliness. Did you think of it using a Dutch angle? Would have made for an interesting picture. Yeah, I, uh, I should have done that. Class, what are your thoughts on this? I think the concept is great, but I agree with Professor Litch. I think it needs a different angle. I see what you were trying to do, and I think it works for the most part. But I do think you should maybe try a different angle. It might work better. I will. Mark, you did a fine job. But I want you to feel your composition a little bit more, OK? OK. Thank you. Thanks, Mark. OK. Hey, don't forget, the Photographer's Showcase is coming up very soon. So, if you want to have your pictures critiqued and displayed, you have to submit them right away. Very important. Okay. Class dismissed. Hey, Martin. Thanks. Everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Hey, great pictures, by the way. Hey, you too, man. Yeah, were they? Yeah, dude. You've grown a lot since you've got here, and you still are. So, try not to take it so hard, man. Yeah, it's hard not to. Look, I gotta get going. Mm. I'll catch you later. Right, see you.
up on the fridge. And you've grown a lot since you got here, and you still are. In this photo, I had used a slower shutter speed in order to capture the movement of the water as well as the static placement of the trees on the side. It's kind of a statement on how, no matter how much life keeps moving, stuff will always be st static around it. In my next photo, it's of a truck that was abandoned out in a field. It's kind of a commentary on how uh, this truck that used to bring us all our comforts and goods in life, once it no longer worked, was abandoned in nature, which we no longer seem to enjoy and thus have abandoned as well. My last photo is that of the quintessential American house. The subject which is captured in here but not exactly seen is the shadow of the tree. I'm using that to kind of convey the message that as normal as an American household may look, there is always some shadow looming over it. Any questions? I really like the photo of the river. I felt like it was taking me on an adventure. Thank you. Yes? Hi. Uh, your photograph with the tractor trailer truck, um, I was really drawn to it. That type of industrial photography, is that something that you plan on delving into more? Well, I'm always looking to expand myself professionally, so yes, that is something I would like to get into. Hi, I'm Elaine. I'm a photographer for the Gazette. And I do like the picture and the message you're trying to portray. Um, I like the shadow effect, but I do feel it's a little bit symmetrical. Oh, um, well, I tried to keep it that way to make sure the shadow wasn't higher prominence in the photo. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I just feel it's a little bit flat. Maybe you could try to uh, set it up at a different angle next time. Yeah, I, I should have done that. Thank you, everyone. Excuse me. I must ask you, why did you get into photography? Because I love it. It's what I'm passionate about. Then why did you get so upset at my comment? I'm just trying to help you. I see your raw talent and passion. I would like to see you succeed. However, you can't succeed if you can't take advice, okay? I understand completely what you're going through. I was once in your position. I tried to be good, I wanted to be good, but not everything I did met my own expectations. Every beginning artist goes through the same thing. It's completely 